Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, His sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ you, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May your, your worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us in the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour, Pour forth, forth, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may, by his passion and cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips. And my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on the sorrowful mysteries. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now and will be forever. Amen. The third sorrowful mystery the crowning with thorns. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be, forever. Amen. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death of our Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O, o Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God. God. Despise not, not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O, o God, God whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech you, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed them in a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, Father who entrusted, entrusted our Savior to the, to the care of St. Joseph, by the help of his prayers, may your Church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. 
Jubilee Prayer. O God, our Father and Creator, in, in whom, whom we live, live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this Jubilee of the Dominican Province of the Philippines. O God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God the Holy Spirit, Advocate and Guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today is Friday, the Memorial of Saint Monica. Saint Monica was born of a Christian family at Agaste in Africa in 331. While still a young maiden, she was married to Patricius. They had children, among whom was Saint Augustine. She poured forth many tears and prayers to God for his conversion. A model of the virtuous mother, she nourished the faith by her prayers and witnessed to it by her deeds. She died at Ostia in 387. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to Him, the dry land too, for it was formed by His hands. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For He is our God and we are His people the flock his shepherds. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness, when at Meribah and Massa they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my younger, they shall not enter into my rest. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Let us sing praise to God as we acclaim Saint Monica. Please be seated. Lord, you will accept the, 
the true sacrifice offered on your altar. Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion, blot out my offense. I o wash me more and more from my guilt, and cleanse me from my sin. My offenses, truly I know them. My sin is always before me. Against you, you alone, have I sinned. What is evil in your sight I have done? That you may be justified when you give sentence, and be without reproach when you judge. O oh, see, in guilt I was born, a sinner was I conceived. Indeed you love truth in the heart, then in the secret of my heart teach me wisdom. O oh, purify me, then I shall be clean. O oh, wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me here rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crushed may revive. From my sins turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart create for me, O God. Put a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your help. With the spirit of fervor sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. O rescue me, God, my helper, and my tongue shall ring out your goodness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight. Burnt offering for me you would refuse. My sacrifice a contrite spirit, a humbled contrite heart you will not spurn. In your goodness show favor to Zion. Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. Then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocausts offered on your altar. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. All the descendants of Israel will glory in the Lord's gift of victory. Truly with you God is hidden, the God of Israel, the Savior. Those are put to shame and disgrace, who vent their anger against him. Those go in disgrace, who carve images. Israel, you are saved by the Lord, saved forever. You shall never be put to shame or disgrace in future ages. For thus says the Lord, the creator of the heavens, who is God, the designer and maker of the earth, who established it, not creating it to be a waste, but designing it to be lived in. I am the Lord, and there is no other. I have not spoken from hiding, nor from some dark place of the earth. And I have not said to the descendants of Jacob, Look for me in an empty waste. I, the Lord, promise justice. I foretell what is right. Come and assemble, gather together, you fugitives among the Gentiles. They are without knowledge, who bear wooden idols, and pray to God that cannot save. Come here and declare in council together, who announced this from the beginning and foretold it from of old. Was it not I, the Lord, besides whom there is no other God? There is no just and saving God but me. Turn to me and be safe, all you ends of the earth, for I am God, there is no other. By myself I swear, uttering my just decree, and my unutterable word. To me every knee shall bend, by me every tongue shall swear, saying, Only in the Lord are just deeds and power. Before him in shame shall come all who vent their anger against him. In the Lord shall be the vindication and the glory of all the descendants of Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now and will be, forever. Amen. Let us go into God's presence, singing for joy. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before Him, singing for joy. Know that He, the Lord, is God. He made us, we belong to Him. We are His people, the sheep of His flock. Go within His gates, giving thanks. Enter his courts with songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Indeed, how good is the Lord. 
eternal his merciful love. He is faithful from age to age. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God, who consoled the sorrowful and who mercifully accepted the motherly tears of Saint Monica for the conversion of her son, Augustine, grant us through the intercession of them both that we may bitterly regret our sins and find the grace of your pardon through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the first letter of St. Paul to the Thessalonians. Brothers and sisters, we earnestly ask and exhort you in the Lord Jesus that, as you receive from us, how you should conduct yourselves to please God, and as you are conducting yourselves, you do so even more. For you know what instructions we gave you through the Lord Jesus. This is the will of God, your holiness, that you refrain from immorality, that each of you know how to acquire a wife for himself in holiness and honor, not in lustful passion, as do the Gentiles do who do not know God. Do not take advantage or exploit a brother or sister in this matter. For the Lord is an avenger of all these things. As we told you before, and solemnly affirm, for God did not call us to impurity, but to holiness. Therefore, whoever disregards this, disregards not a human being, but God, who also gives his Holy Spirit to you. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Rejoice in the Lord, ye just. Rejoice in the Lord, you just. The Lord is King, let the earth rejoice. Let the many isles be glad. Justice and judgment are the foundations of his throne. Rejoice in the Lord, you just. The mountains melt like wax before the Lord, before the Lord of all the earth. The heavens proclaim his justice, and all peoples see his glory. Rejoice in the Lord, you just. The Lord loves those who hate evil. He guards the lives of his faithful ones. From the hand of the wicked, he delivers them. Rejoice in the Lord, you just. Light dawns for the just, and gladness for the upright of heart. Be glad in the Lord, you just, and give thanks to his holy name. Rejoice in the Lord, you just. Please stand. Be vigilant at all times and pray that you may have the strength to stand before the Son of Men.
The Lord be with you and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus told his disciples this parable. The kingdom of heaven may be like ten virgins who took their lamps and went out to meet the bridegroom. Five of them were foolish and five were wise. The foolish ones, when taking their lamps, brought no oil with them, but the wise brought flask of oil with their lamps. Since the bridegroom was long delayed, they all became drowsy and fell asleep. At midnight, there was a cry, Behold, the bridegroom, come out to meet him. Then all those virgins got up and trimmed their lamps. The foolish ones said to the wise, Give us some of your oil, for our lamps are going out. But the wise ones replied, No, for there were may not be enough for us and you. Go instead to the merchants and buy some for yourselves. While they went off to buy, the bridegroom came, and those who were ready went into the wedding feast with him. Then the door was locked. Afterwards, the other virgins came and said, Lord, Lord, open the door for us. But he replied, Amen, I say to you, I do not know you. Therefore, stay awake, for you know neither the day nor the hour. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Nakakapagod po maghintay sa taong hindi natin alam kung kailan darating. Na hindi man lang nagpasabi kung malapit na ba o madedelay ba ng konteng pagdating. Para man lang makapaghanda tayo at para man lang hindi masayang yung oras natin. Nakakapagod po maghintay. Yung iba nga, kakaantay nila sa kanilang Mr. Right o Miss Perfect ay napaglipasan na po ng panahon. Namunti na mga mata nila. Nanigas na parang bangkay. Wala ng buhay. Kasi hindi pa dumadating yung icing sa cupcake nila. At dahil nakakapagod maghintay, ay nakatulog sila. Ang mga birhen sa kwento, yung sampung dalaga, at sa lamang, malamang karamihan sa mga taong dumalo sa pagtitipon, ay nakatulog din dahil sa antok at pagod. Ang masayang pagtitipon na puno sana ng sayawan, ng kantahan, ng inuman, at pananabik na makita ang lalaking ikakasal, ay nauwi sa antok at pagod dahil naantala ang kanyang pagdating. Sinasabi lang po ng Ibanghelyo sa araw na ito na ang Diyos ay kumikilos hindi ayon sa schedule natin. Hindi ayon sa anong kagustuhan natin because His ways are not our ways and His plans are sometimes not our plans. Kaya hindi natin pwedeng sabihin at diktahan ang Diyos na gawin mo ito, Lord. At lahat ng ipagdadasal natin ay pagkakaloob niya. Sasabihin natin, Lord, ito yung taong gusto ko. Ipilit na natin, Lord. Sige na, Lord. Ito yung gusto kong mangyari sa buhay ko. At the age of 30, may asawa na ako. 
Meron na akong hanap buhay na maganda. Meron na akong malawak na lupain, Lord. Ipilit natin, Lord. Hindi po natin pwedeng diktahan ang Diyos sa anumang kagustuhan natin. Alam niyo po, at kapag hindi po natin, minsan, pag hindi nag, na, naaayon sa kagustuhan natin, minsan, gusto na lang nating magalit, magtampo, magduda sa pag-ibig ng Diyos. At minsan, tinutulugan na natin ang Diyos. Normal lang po ang makatulog pareho ng mga hangal at ng mga matatalinong dalaga sa Ebanghelyo ay nakatulog po sila. Yung nakatulog na dahil sa lungkot, dahil sa tampo, dahil siguro sa galit o pagdududa sa Diyos. Pero alam niyo po kung anong pinagkaiba ng mga dalagang hangal sa mga dalagang matatalino? Ang mga matatalinong dalaga po ay hindi na, nawala ng ilaw at naubusan ng langis. Yun po ang paraan ng paghihintay. Huwag kang mawala ng ilaw, huwag kang maubusan ng langis. At ano po ba yung langis at ilaw? Ang ilaw po ay sumisimbolo sa buhay. Kaya nga po, yung mga taong buhay na buhay ay nagliliwanag. Tingnan nyo po, yung mga blooming dyan, buhay na buhay. Dahil lahat ng kanilang ginagawa ay puno ng sigla. Masigla sila sa kanilang relasyon, sa kanilang buhay, sa kanilang pakikitungo sa tao. Buhay na buhay habang naghihintay. Kaya nga po, yung mga buhay na buhay, yung mga blooming, mas lalo silang gumaganda at gumagwapo dahil napaka-graceful ng mga ginagawa nila. Tingnan po ninyo yung katabi ninyo. Blooming po ba yan? Buhay na buhay pa ba? O parang lantang gulay na, na wala na ng buhay, hindi na masaya. At ang ilaw na po ito ay nagsisilbing gabay para makita ang iba, ng iba ang patutunguhan nila. Kapag buhay na buhay tayo, we inspire other people. Kaya nga po, yung mga madres, yung mga padres dito, dapat buhay na buhay para ma-inspire nila yung mga taong malungkot, yung mga taong kailangan ng inspirasyon sa buhay. Kaya't kayo rin sana, tingnan ninyong sarili ninyo, blooming pa ba ako? Buhay pa ba ako? Masaya pa ba ako? At upang hindi po patuloy na mawalan ng alab ang ating mga ilaw, kailangan natin ng langis. Ano po yung langis? Yung langis po na ginamit ng mabuting Samaritano sa pagpapagaling ng lalaking binubog at pinagnakawan. Ito po yung langis na ipinahid upang italaga ang misiyas na nagbigay ng pag-asa sa sangkatauhan. Ang langis na ito po ay iyo lang. Iyo lang. Kagaya ng mga matatalinong berhen o dalaga, hindi nila ibinigay yung langis. Kahit napkaya nilang tulungan yung mga hangal na dalaga, hindi nila maibigay dahil yung langis na yun ay kanya lang, kanila lang. At yung langis na yan ay iyo lang dahil ang langis na yan ay ang iyong personal na ugnayan sa Diyos. Ito yung langis na kailanman ay matatandaan mo 
kung paano ka tinulungan, kung paano ka inalagaan, kung paano ka pinaglaban, at kung paano ka inibig, minahal ng Diyos. At yung eksperyensyang yun, iyo lang. Hindi mo pwedeng ibigay sa iba. Lahat tayo may eksperyensya ng pagmamahal ng Diyos. At yun ang magpapaalab, ang langis na magpapaalab sa ilaw natin. Kaya nga hindi natin pwedeng ibigay at ipahiram sa iba. Dahil ang langis na yan ay patuloy na dapat mong ingatan na kahit saan daladala mo. Dahil sa mga panahon na nauubusan ka na ng ilaw, na nauubusan ka na ng sigla ng buhay, yun ang ilalagay mo. Ang langis na magpapaalab sa nanlalamig mong puso. Kaya nga po, yun ang paanyaya sa atin. Na kapag tayo ay maghihintay sa pagdating ng Diyos, kailangan natin ingatan na huwag mawalan ng ilaw, na huwag maubusan ng langis. Dahil ang ilaw at langis na yan ang mag magiging handa, magpapahanda sa atin sa pagdating ng Panginoon. At kapag siya ay dumating na tayo ay puno ng ilaw, nagliliwanag at puno ng langis, tayo ay magiging blooming at puno ng pananabik na sa lubungin ng Diyos. Kahit matagal, kahit hindi natin alam kung kailan, Basta, darating siya. Darating siya. Kaya't huwag nating hayaan mamatay ang ilaw, maubusan ng langis. Please stand. The gospel message reminds us to be wise and vigilant as we wait for the coming of the Lord Jesus. Let us pray for the world he has redeemed. Let your response be, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the church may read the signs of the times and constantly remind God's people of the eternal dimension of life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our, our prayer. That young people may remain hopeful and enthusiastic about life. May their idealism aid them in pursuing great things in life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That those discouraged and wounded by life may not grow bitter, but draw fresh strength and hope from Christ who promised us his presence. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That the sick and the dying may look to Christ with hope and penitent trust. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For the intentions of the devotees of the Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, for our personal intentions, and the intentions of this Mass. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayer. That those who have died may join the Lord in His kingdom forever. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. Let us continue to pray for all our frontliners, for all those who continue to help us in this fight against COVID-19. We pray for the enlightenment and guidance of our leaders, both in the church and in the government, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Father of time and eternity, grant the petitions we have made as we wait for the coming of Christ, your gift of eternal wisdom. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, for through the earth work of human hands it will become for us a bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, for the divine work of human hands it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. We bring you the sacrificial gifts, O Lord, to commemorate Blessed Monica, humbly entreating that they may bestow on us both pardon and salvation through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Let Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is only right and just our duty and our salvation. Always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for you are praised in the company of your saints and in crowning their merits, you crown your own gifts. By their way of life, you offer us an example. By communion with them, you give us companionship. By their intercession, sure support, so that encouraged by so great a cloud of witnesses, we may run as victors in the race before us and win with them the imperishable crown of glory through Christ our Lord. And so with the angels and archangels and with a great multitude of the saints, we sing the hymn of your praise as without end we acclaim. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. May call it therefore these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take these, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take these, all of you, and drink from it. For this is a chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith.
Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life in the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you've held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partake of the body and blood of Christ may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, Socrates, our Archbishop, Fidelis, our Auxiliary Bishop, Gerard, the Master of the Order of Preachers, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs of eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. stand. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our, Our Father, who art in heaven, 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 hallowed be thy name, name thy kingdom, kingdom come, thy will be done on earth, earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give, Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as, as we, we forgive those who trespass, trespass against, against us. us. And lead, lead us not into temptation, temptation but deliver us from, from evil. evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, Gr graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to the apostles, Peace I live you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith but on the faith of your church and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who we'll live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. My dear friends, behold our Lord Jesus Christ, our healer, the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. How blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Please all stand. You answered her prayer, O Lord. You did not disregard her tears, which fell upon the earth wherever she prayed. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginnings, now and will be, forever. Amen. You answered her prayer, O Lord. You did not disregard her tears, which fell upon the earth wherever she prayed. Let us pray. May the working of this divine sacrament enlighten and inflame us, Almighty God, on this feast day of Blessed Monica, that we may ever fervent with holy desires and abound in good works to Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated for some announcements. The Dominican community of the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag is pleased to inform you that the October Feast of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag will be on October 3, 2021, the first Sunday of October. The Novena Masses will be scheduled at 6 a.m., 7.30 a.m., 9 a.m., 10.30 a.m., 12 noon, and 4.30 p.m., from September 24 to October, 22, to October 2 of 2021. Additional Mass at 3 p.m. on September 26, Sunday. We invite you to participate in this Novena Masses and be one with us in expressing our devotion to Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. If you wish to sponsor one or several of the Novena Masses, you may fill out the form at the counters for Masses area and submit it with your donation, and you will be given an acknowledgement receipt. Or you may visit our website, www.manawagminorbasilica.org at Online Pamisa, where you will find available online and other options for donation. All names of donors and sponsors for Novena Masses will appear in the Electronic Souvenir Program. Thank you very much for your continued support. God bless you. Please all stand. Ang ibig sabihin lang po nung announcement na yon ay tuloy ang piyesta. Kahit anong mangyari, tuloy ang ating pagdiriwang ng kapistahan ng Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag ngayong Tubre. And this is going to be something special because ngayong uh, October din po sa, uh, sa taong ito, we're going to launch, launch the five years na preparation leading to the celebration ng centennial ng kanyang canonical coronation. 2026 pa po yun, but uh, we're doing a five-year uh, activity uh, leading to that uh, coronation po. And on October din po, we're going to launch yung Misa Apubaket. No? So if that is, if you hear yung songs na yun sa Misa, uh, you know very much that it's something that uh, originates here in uh, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag Minor Basilica. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. And may the Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The Mass is offered. Go in peace. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. To God. We shall now say the prayer for the blessing po ng mga may sakit 
and to be followed by the prayer for the blessing ng religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters, freedom from all illness, and restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, we will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this to Christ our Lord. Amen. Para naman sa inyong religious articles, we bless them. In memory of the miseries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may your religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen.